Hi guys, good morning. Welcome back to my channel. It is now Vlogmas Day 13. I'm kind of really messed up because I was supposed to post, I have Vlogmas Day 11 ready to go and it's with the brand and they didn't get back to me yesterday and I don't think they know that I'm doing Vlogmas so um, I just didn't end up posting the video because they have to approve it and they haven't got back to me. So, that's really annoying because it's like I had 11 ready to go and now I'm going to have to skip it and that's so annoying to me because, like I said, I had it. But anyways, um, also day 12, yesterday I was very busy so the vlog is going to be very boring but yeah, so I'm going to edit that later and then today I'll be filming for day 13. And today, my mom still has Gabriel, but I might go pick him up. She's just, like, letting me know, I guess, what to do, because I don't really know. Um, but, so, that's going to kind of dictate the day. So, if we do go pick him up, we'll probably just, like, go grocery shopping later and then stay at home. But if not, we are going to Christmas shop for him today, then grocery shop, and then come home and clean and stuff like that. So, just, like, your typical Saturday. I actually have to drop off some packages, too. Um, if I end up having enough time, but my mom lives like an hour and 30 minutes away So it kind of like takes up a good chunk of the day when I have to go get him. So we'll see But yeah, I made peppermint coffee this morning with the Nespresso peppermint pods and it is so good and I put the silk um, Dark chocolate almond milk creamer and it's really really good. So I think it would be better ice too but anyways That's it. I will update you guys. I hate vlogging in the car because I feel like everyone in their cars are staring at me. But anyways, I have to tell you guys something that's annoying me so bad and I need to just rant. So, I do like my Poshmark Macari thrifting type stuff. Um, so, I have like packages that all ship out. Like, I try and wait until I get like a bunch of them and then I ship them out at one time. But anyways, on December 3rd, I shipped out like a bunch of packages. And both of the other packages have already gone to the buyer and I've already received money but this one package that I thought would be an issue but I just kind of like shoved it in the package and closed it is still saying that it's awaiting um to be sent to my post office even though it was already at my post office so we called the post office and she was just so rude she was like it's in the bend. I don't know. She was so rude. But what I don't understand is why everyone else has got their packages except that one package didn't get shipped. So I think it's lost. And that girl was not trying to be helpful at, at all and like help me find it. Or I know they're super busy right now because it's like Christmas time and stuff. But also like you don't have to be rude. You can be helpful. That is your job. Do you understand? Like that is your job. Like, if I worked at the post office, it would be my job to help people find their packages because that is your job. And I'm just kind of frustrated because that means I'm out a sweater and money. And it was a nice sweater. It was like a Michael Kors sweater. So, I'm just really frustrated and annoyed. But I understand that it's Christmas season and things are busy. So, I am giving her the benefit of the doubt and I'm going to just pretend that she, like she said it's just waiting to be shipped even though I think that it's either lost or they have it and there was an issue with the package and they're trying to return it to me and they haven't yet but I was rolling my eyes but like seriously I'm just frustrated it's fine though um I just hope the buyer doesn't like get any more pissed off than she already is because like I really it's like out of my hands office and now this is like my fault that it's gone you know and I then I'm gonna get a bad review saying that like you know it's just frustrating but anyways I'm not gonna let it ruin my day I guess um, we're about to go Christmas shopping we're going to like go to Ross and see if we can pick out a couple toys for Gabriel he's already getting so many toys from my mom and my sister and I'm sure your dad will get him something that I don't want to buy him a ton but like maybe three or four things and plus we got him like a tablet so we'll see what we end up getting but I hate vlogging in the car because I feel like people are staring at me so I'm gonna go do you have anything to say no you never do do you not like YouTube 
I do, but I'm not. It's your YouTube. I'm not you don't have anything it. to say. No. You can be interesting. I'm not interesting. Okay. Anyways, I gotta go. This. Is, see, look at this. <laughs> you can't see anything. There's cars on both sides of me, and I just feel. Why do we gotta be in the middle? Why can't we be on the side? Currently at a gas station. We just got done with breakfast. I showed like a five second clip of my breakfast, but I got tiramisu French toast. It's like a local special and it is. Uh, um, guys, we just picked up Duncan. It is a lot later now. It's clearly dark outside. And now we're going grocery shopping. Cheers. <laughs> he doesn't like it. You don't? It's just milk and coffee? Yeah. Do you want me to run and get you sweetener? Are you going to drink it? Yeah. Are you sure I can get you see Um, I got inside. They have packages. Of sugar. Um, I got a nice coffee with almond milk. Okay, so I just we just got home from grocery shopping and um. I just filmed a grocery haul and put all the groceries away, and now I'm gonna do like a cook with me type thing. I'm gonna make like a spicy rigat rigatoni. Um, like vodka pasta. It's actually I saw it all over Instagram. Like G Gigi Hadid like posted it, but I don't know that she invented it <laughs> because vodka sauce is a thing. But people act like she invented it anyway. Um, I found the recipe from someone on Pinterest though, but she called it Gigi Hadid's spicy vodka pasta or something like that. But it seems super easy, and I've made something like this before like where you just use heavy cream and like tomato paste and cheese but this time we're adding like red pepper and vodka in it so we'll see how that is but we're also gonna make like a cranberry vodka drink and watch a movie I guess while we eat it and then I have to edit because I have a lot to do editing wise and that's about it so i'm just waiting for the water to boil and then i'll show you guys the recipe onion and garlic and I have it in here with a fourth a cup of olive oil I kind of just eyed it I think a fourth a cup is a lot of oil but that's what the recipe says so we're just gonna let these cook for a little while until they're like caramelized and Zach just took the noodles out of the water so after we let this cook we can add our heavy cream and stuff and it'll basically be done okay so we're about to make a little drink we just have random glasses because that's all we had but we're just gonna throw some light cranberry in it i'm gonna put some of this in mine i don't know if zach wants any and then we have some vodka which i also need for my um pasta so let's make it do you want me to like put the uh, do it should we start with vodka yeah like a shot no do it like half full no, half. I'm not doing that much. Here, I got a shot. You Give can me get a shot. Shot, shot, shot. The vodka still so has a smell, so we're like straight up rubbing up. You want the big shot or the short small. shot? Small. Don't break that. They're both huge, so I'll probably just. Why? Why you say you don't from, break it? It's from Germany. Let's see how much this is. Yeah, that's perfect. Use the bigger one. And then should I do cranberry next or I'll do the soda. Excellent.
You got me a couple more. Isis? Yay, I'll wait for you to try it. I'm gonna straw though. Cheers. Mine's watery, but it's very good. That's fire. Did you put that in it? It makes it good, I swear. Yum, this is so good. Mine's a little bit watery, but I can't really taste vodka at all. Okay, so our onions and like stuff is a little bit soft, so I'm gonna go ahead and add a fourth of a cup of tomato paste. Um, and then we cook it until basically all like the onions are caramelized or like coated in the tomato paste. Okay, so now I'm adding a tablespoon of vodka to this mixture and we're, you just cook it until it's all gone. Till it evaporates, yeah. Just some flavors, taste. Mm hmm I turned it down a little bit. Okay. Okay, it. so now I'm adding a half a cup of heavy cream to the mixture, and then we're gonna do a teaspoon, sorry, Zach. A teaspoon of red pepper chili flakes, but the recipe says you can add more if you want it hotter, so I'm guessing it's just like a tiny bit spicy. But we're just gonna do a teaspoon. be liquidy as the sauce. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the vibe it's just a little spicy. Remember that one Prego used to make that we can't find anymore. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so now we're just gonna add pepper and salt. And then I'm gonna let it just warm up for a minute and then once that's done we're gonna add pasta. Okay, so now I'm gonna add our pasta. I don't know if I wanna do all of this, so we'll see. This is so heavy. Oh, I feel like that's so much. We'll see. Um, and then we add a fourth of a cup of the pasta water, but I didn't save any, so I'm just using regular hot water. And I guess we mix it together. All right, so now we're just adding a tablespoon of butter in there and then we stir it around until it melts. Okay, now we're adding... Okay. Now we're adding a fourth a cup of Parmesan cheese, but honestly, I'm just gonna add it. And we're gonna stir that up until it melts. All right, so that is the pasta all plated. I topped it with a little bit of Parmesan cheese, but it looks so good. I will let you guys know how we Guys, go. I look so crazy right now, but it is currently Sunday and we had kind of a busy morning. It's 12, 17 and we're just now getting back home. We had to go pick up Gabriel from my mom's house and it's kind of far away. So we had to make that drive. We left at like eight this morning and we're just now getting back. So I have like a ton of stuff to do around the house, but we are gonna order some pizza really quickly to um just have a quick lunch because we're both really hungry and it's football day so Zach I guess wants pizza but um that's why I'm wearing the same shirt that I've worn <laughs> the last like two vlogs because um I was gonna retire it but then Zach was like you should wear it because it's football day it's Miami Dolphins are playing so that's why I'm wearing the same shirt but anyway I wanted to just start the vlog for today because I haven't done that yet but I'm probably just gonna chill for a little bit and then I really need to get up and get things done around the house. I just started some laundry, so I just really need to deep clean my kitchen, my bathroom, all of those things. Ugh, the weekend just went so quickly and yeah, but I had fun. Like me and Zach got breakfast together at one point. We went Christmas shopping. What else did we do? Grocery shopping last night, so we got a lot of things done, so I'm happy about that, but I'm also happy it's Sunday because it's like a whole new 
week and you get to like reset your day so I'm gonna get my house clean today and do laundry and Gabriel's back so I'm happy Tua Tua he's having a little popsicle do you want to show him come show him he's having one of those little popsicles what color is that pink purple purple good job BB I missed you oh same day more oh I know day. You will see her very soon. I'm simply yes. soon. I ate my candy. You did? Uh huh. That's cool. All right. Please, please. So he's going to eat that, and I'm going to chill for a minute until our mm. pizza arrives and then get to clean. All right, guys. I'm in Gabriel's bedroom. Giant set on my face, but he wants the lights off, don't you? He wanted the lights off, so now we're sitting here in the dark, and it's making me even more tired. I got a shower so I could kind of wake up, but I'm probably going to make a coffee, and then hopefully I have some energy. Unless somebody wants to nap. Do you want a nap? In my bed? No, on my bed. I can't fit on your bed. What? See? Well, I can't fit on your bed. I'm too big. Oh, what? Sit on your Hello. All right, guys, so that was all I filmed yesterday. I actually had a really horrible day yesterday, so I just didn't end up filming anything, so I'm so sorry about that, but hopefully we can get back to our reg regular scheduled vlogs. I just feel like um, me waiting on that brand has seriously messed up my filming because I just don't know when that video will go up. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed, um, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.